Good morning. It's day eight. I took a day off in Lake Tahoe, Tahoe City. Uh, I got food, laundry. Now I'm back on trail. I plan to do 13 miles today to Watson Lake. Apparently this section is very dry, meaning there's no water. So hopefully I brought enough water to last. Made it to camp after 15 miles. Uh, this is my tent. Making ramen right here. Having dinner, seven o'clock. Uh, mosquitoes aren't too bad. Good first day back. Good morning. Off and rolling this morning. About three miles in. It's 11 o'clock ish. Uh, have enough water, thankfully. It is a dry section, so it's not a lot of water to go around. But I uh, should be doing another 12 miles today. And apparently, we're getting up in elevation. So that would be cool. Pretty sure that's a fire right there. I've never seen any clouds like that before. Guess we'll find out. Good morning. I think it is day 10. I have 10 to 12 miles to do today. Uh, last night was interesting. It rained, poured for about an hour. So I was running down the hill to the campsite. So I didn't film last night. But uh, today, the weather should be good. It shouldn't be raining. Seems like there's a thunderstorm every afternoon. And that's about it. Climbing up. Just made it to the top of Relay Peak, the highest point on the Tahoe Rim Trail at 10,300 feet. A lot of hikers up there. Clouds are looking a little dark. Hopefully it doesn't rain on me again because I don't want to be wet again like last night. Um, I have another seven or eight miles to go today. It's 12 o'clock. Well, I'm smelling a lot of smoke up here uh, towards Reno down this valley. It's really hazy. Uh, I'm not sure how close the fire is. 
I'm assuming I'm at a safe distance because they would have closed this trail if there was any fire danger at all. I'm wondering if that's the same fire I saw three or four days ago. Probably is. But uh, I'm about probably 14 miles in today. I wanted to hike a little longer when I got to my original campsite. And that was before I noticed the smoke. And uh, I've started to wear my mask to filter out the smoke. Hopefully I can uh, rest easy tonight. And there won't be a fire at my tent in the morning. So for now, keep on trucking. Well, today was longer than I expected, to say at the least. Uh, I think I probably did like 16 to 18 miles. I was only supposed to do like 10. Partly because when I got to my original campsite, it was like three o'clock, still sunny out, and it wasn't really a campsite. So I looked on my phone to see what's the next campsite is, and it was three miles away. And after three miles, I got to the campsite, and there was a wall of smoke, and the air smelled like fire. So I was like, oh shit, is there a fire nearby? So I went on my phone, uh, checked with my dear parents, who assured me that um, there was a fire, but it was like 30 miles, like completely opposite direction. There still wasn't any uh, campsites nearby, so I had to hike another three to four miles. But I found the spot, and it's about 6.30. I'll we'll set up my tent, um, have dinner. I think tomorrow shouldn't be too bad. I should be able to sleep in a little bit probably have another maybe 10 miles or so tomorrow. Good morning. I think it's day 13 or 12. I lost count a while back. But uh, I woke up this morning at 6.30. Got on the road by seven and the smoke today isn't too bad, but you can tell it's a little hazy over Lake Tahoe. Uh, I don't know if the views are gonna be as crystal clear as I want it to be. Well, I made like a mile detour to this uh, scenic overlook of Lake Tahoe. And uh, it's pretty amazing. Uh, it's kind of insane to think that uh, I hiked around this whole lake. But you can definitely tell like it's a little smoggy or like, you know, there's smoke in the air. But uh, I bet in sunset, Amazing. Well, it's about five o'clock in the afternoon. I'm still hiking. Probably done 16 miles or so. Um, I just crossed a very busy road intersection. I'm thankful to be alive because that was traffic coming two lanes, both sides. So it's like a highway. Anyway, uh, plan is to hike another three or four miles in. Apparently there's a good campsite up there, a good sunset. 
and uh, I stopped for like half an hour at a uh, the trailhead down there where I crossed the road and had some snacks and went to the bathroom uh, relaxed for a bit so it looks pretty dark but uh, I think I'm gonna keep on trucking and see where uh, where tonight takes me Well, uh, I made my camp, kind of tucked in some trees. It was pouring for about an hour, and now it's completely clear. Uh, there was lightning and a lot of thunder. Um, sort of a mad scramble the last half an hour. I was rushing to find a tent, tent spot, and uh, I just found this one kind of tucked away so my tent is a little bit wet inside because it took a while to get the uh rain tarp up looks like tomorrow is about 15 miles of hiking i thought it was only be like 10 or 11 but i uh underestimated so one last night in the back country Well, after about two weeks of hiking, I finally made it to the junction. So that means I am officially completed the Tahoe Rim Trail. This is a little marker I uh, touched two weeks ago. Uh, that way is the direction I started. And you can see there's a sign up here that tells you it's Tahoe City on the bottom, 87 miles. And Star Lake was the lake I uh, started with the first night, the first campsite. So that's 165 miles. And uh, it feels good. It feels really good. Go! Woohoo! I got another half a mile for the uh, bus bus stop, and from there it should take me to um, South Lake Tahoe. But uh, I'm gonna celebrate tonight. Well, I finally made it down to. South Lake Tahoe, having my dinner. Uh, it's pretty sweet right now, I'm watching an awesome sunset. But um, yeah, it's a pretty good trip. I enjoyed it a lot. My dinner's fantastic. Um, I enjoyed the hike a lot. <laughs> 